Who needs sweet potato fries when you can have crispy garlic parmesan carrot fries for about half the carbs? To make them, you'll need three carrots, medium size, about six to seven ounces total, around 200 grams. You'll just cut each carrot in half, and then each half and half, you'll be able to cut about six fries from the larger end and four from the smaller end, if that makes sense. Try to get these as even as possible, just so you have you know even crispiness. You don't want really burned tiny bits, tiny fries, but once the camera's rolling, all bets are off. Once you have your fries, drizzle about a tablespoon of olive oil, give it a quick toss, and then we're gonna hit it with a little bit of granulated garlic or garlic powder, and I'll put all the ingredients down in the description below. A Little bit of crushed red pepper. You can leave the red pepper out, a little bit of black pepper, you can also omit that. You can change up the seasoning however you want. My original recipe, and I'll link it down below as well, has fresh crushed garlic kind of infused into the olive oil. It's a little bit more work, but it, it's really delicious. But just know you can really experiment with your seasoning here. Then we're gonna go two tablespoons of grated Parmesan. I just buy the cheap grocery store pre-grated stuff here straight out of the refrigerator. We'll give it a toss, make sure these are evenly coated. If you don't throw a fry out of the bowl, I don't really think you're shaking hard enough, so be sure you throw one out, get these evenly coated. Then we're gonna go into or onto an air fryer basket. Uh, this is just an air fryer tray in an Instant Pot Vortex Pro. This cooks a little bit faster than some of my other air fryers, but go 350, you don't wanna go too hot, otherwise you'll burn the Parmesan coating before the fries cook through. So go with a lower temperature for longer. Some of my other air fryers take 15 to 20 minutes. This one cooks on the top rack about 10 minutes. Uh, you can also do this in the oven. I'll put notes below. For a dip, you can go with it whatever you want here. We've got about a fourth cup of fat-free Greek yogurt, tablespoon sriracha, tablespoon of lime juice. I've also used Calabrian chili oil and a little bit of ketchup. Use whatever you want here. Hit these with a little flaky salt, a little bit of parsley, and get to snacking.